Every child needs a friend. Every child needs a hand. Every child needs someone in their corner. The learning's just begun. So come and have some fun. Inspired to be anything you want. Welcome to Kyra's Corner. Butterflies, let's learn. Hello, beautiful butterflies. It's so good to see those beautiful faces out there. Miss Kyra is always so excited to see you. Today, I am cooking some stew. Did you see it's so cold outside? It's cold and it's raining. So Miss Kyra thought, hmm, let's make a stew today for the family. I have black beans cooking and I have some onions. It still needs a little bit of seasoning. So I'm gonna season it a little bit more with some salt and pepper. <laughs> and it's gonna taste so good. I have my little testing spoon here. Let's see. Mm. Oh my goodness, it's dripping. <laughs> it's so good, butterflies. I'm gonna let this simmer. Turn the eye down just a little bit. There we go. And then I'm gonna ask my husband to watch over it because I have such an incredible story for you today. Let's go into Kyra's Corner so we can start reading our new story. You're just gonna love it. I just know it. Come on. <laughs> I have an incredible story that I'm gonna read to you and you are gonna love it. It's called What's in the Pot? This story has positive messages and it has something yummy cooking up. Which is why Miss Kyra started making that black eyed pea and vegetable stew upstairs. I want you to look out for words that start with the letter P. Words that start with the letter P. Pot. And please. Please is a word that starts with the letter P too. After the story, we're going to talk about some positive messages that we learned from this story. But there's a word for those positive messages that we learned. Ah, I can't wait. Go sit down, relax, and cuddle up with your family as we read What's in the Pot. What's in the Pot by Haley Alonzo, Crystal Warren, and Rat Western. What's for supper? Asked Sam. It's a surprise, said Mama, putting a big pot on the stove. She added a jug of water. Sam was worried. Are we having water for supper? He wailed. It's a surprise. Wait and see, replied Mama. Can I help? asked Sam. I could stir. You are still a bit short, said Mama. The pot might fall over, but you can help me by fetching things. Can you bring me an onion, please? Ugh. That doesn't smell very nice. They will taste nice once they are cooked. Now I need some tomatoes. No, that is an apple. The tomatoes are also round and red, but you will find them in the fridge. Can you bring me potatoes? They are round and brown. Is supper ready yet? If you 
you are hungry, you can eat the apple while you wait. What about these? No, we won't need biscuits. We can save those for after supper. What's in the pot? It's a surprise. Wait and see. What about this? That is a watermelon. It will be too big for the pot. See if you can find some spinach. It is also green. Please get some bread. No, it won't go into the pot, but on the table. Mama carried the pot to the table and started to dish up. What's in the pot? asked Sam. Soup! My favorite! The end. Wasn't that an incredible story? I told you, butterflies. I love that story. Did you listen out for those words that start with the letter P? Yes! Pot! Pot starts with the letter P. Pot! That's a good job! Way to go! What is another word? Did you listen for please? Yes! Please! Very good! Remember, Miss Kyra said there's a very special word that I would love to go over with you after the story. That word is patience. Yes, patience. Patience starts with the letter P too. Now that is the positive message. Also, there's another positive message, which is helping helping your parents out while they're cooking. But remember, you have to wait first for your instructions. That would be patience. And also, patience is when you're waiting for something good. You're waiting very quietly and while something good is about to happen. And look, he got his favorite soup that his mother is cooking for him. I love that story because of the positive messages and we just learned like three words. Okay, high five. <laughs> Pot, patience, and please. Until next time, beautiful butterflies, take care. And remember, ask your parents or someone you love and trust if you can help them while cooking something up for dinner. <laughs> Bye! If you would like to see another episode of Kyra's Corner, please subscribe and click like. I can't wait to see you beautiful butterflies again. Remember, be kind to each other and be kind to yourself. <laughs>